Yeah, living with the Northwoods, we're trying to explore our relationship with Northwoods history, culture, tradition, and landscape. Last year, the Warehouse Art Center had a project called Connect to the Northwoods. This year, they decided to evolve. This uh, grew out of that. Uh, living with the Northwoods pushes on the question of with, living with versus living in. And we plan on doing this every year now. Donna Murray, the executive director, says the main centerpiece of the art exhibit is a unique birch bark canoe made by Wayne Valier from Lac de Fambo. And he also led the project in the wigwam that's out in the courtyard. So um, this is one of his canoes, and it's normally on display in the Lac de Flambeau Elementary School. While the logistics of setting up the exhibit were difficult, the lesson was much more important. It's difficult because this is our art education classroom, and to turn it into a museum means we have to teach our classes elsewhere. But um, we wanted everybody to have access to this knowledge. Donna hopes that when people appear at the warehouse, they get to see how much skill the Ojibwe people put into creating birch bark art and crafts. Boy, my favorite thing is just seeing the eyes light up when people come in and, and you know, just when, when you can present a wow to somebody and they can say, wow, I didn't know you could, you could take a 20-foot piece of birch bark off of a tree. And to teach the community a lesson about how great art could be. We have to have art in our life to keep us going, to keep us joyful, to keep us hopeful, to, to, to help us learn things. Reporting in Eagle River, Muhammad Abdul-Kawi, News Watch 12.